When I started compiling my videos from the time that I lived in New York City last year, I thought of doing a vlog showing how much I badly miss it. I kept on saying, I miss this, I miss that, blah, and it didn't really help me with my emotional state, especially with what's going on in the world right now. Thankfully, I was able to snap at myself and basically I forced myself to hold back a few words. I do miss New York, but now I choose to express it in a way that will be an inspiration to me. Or maybe even to you. I'm looking forward to being in New York again. I'm looking forward to buying the unlimited metro card so I can swipe it and swipe it and just go wherever the fuck I want. I'm looking forward to checking every seat on the train if they're clean. I'm also excited to see the dirty ones and observe how other people would react when they see it. Most New Yorkers would keep a blank face and just find another seat, but tourists would always show their sour faces and then change cars or even wait for the next train. I'm excited to see random performers in the train again. Sometimes though, I feel bad for watching them and then I pretend to sleep when they're done and they're collecting because I didn't have extra money and I'm sorry. I'm looking forward to the two-hour ride from Queens to Coney Island. I'm excited to find a spot put down my blanket, bring out the food that I bought from Koreatown, and eat while looking at the beach. I'm not that crazy about swimming after this one time that I tried the water, but damn, I'm excited to lay down under the sun for hours. I'm looking forward to offering tourists that they want me to take a picture of them because I could see them struggling. I want to see their smiles again, but more importantly, I'm looking forward to them asking me if they want my picture taken in return I wouldn't say no, of course. It's always nice to have other people take my photo for me for a change. Speaking of, I'm also excited to look stupid as I try to take my own travel photos. I'm excited to be creeped out in some sketchy tunnel, but I'm more excited to feel the freedom as I come up and see the glorious tall buildings in Manhattan. I look forward to running with my fellow busy people, I look forward to staying for hours in my favorite cafe if I have the time. I look forward to chilling in the middle of Central Park for a little peace and quiet or even riding the tram to Roosevelt Island when I need a breather from seeing a lot of humans. Ah, I want to sleep there again. Yes, you can do that and people won't bother you because most likely they're sleeping in one of the benches too. I look forward to witnessing more events. It would also make me so happy to see my fellow Filipinos gather for our own amazing artists again. We sure know how to have fun. I can't wait to pick a random bus or train again and ride it without knowing where it would go. Wait, I do that with a bike too. I am just so excited to get lost again. I look forward to breaking a few rules every now and then. Sorry mom. I'm excited to be surprised. I'm excited to appreciate more. It has been fun, New York City, and I am just looking forward to more experiences with you. I promise I will see you again, and when that right time comes, it will be for good.